so this is the reason why cement is now uh, costly in Nigeria from 3,000 to 4,000 to 6,000 now a bag of cement is close to more than 15,000 naira the Minister of Works and Housing in Nigeria um, engineer Dave Umahi he likes using cement to make his road construction he has done that in Ebony State through almost all the roads he constructed in Ebony State they use cement and now that is the Minister of Works he has ordered the contractor, majorly Gilos Vega, and other construction company that the federal government you know, hired to build these roads, to use cement to build these roads. And that's why Gilos Vega have now bought this, of course, the major cement that we are, there are a lot of cement companies in Nigeria, but the, the company that is producing mass cement in Nigeria is uh, Dangote Cement or Dango Cement. So uh, Gilos Vega have now bought this uh dango cement in large quantity and that's why there is scarcity remember that uh, dangote just moved into an um, uh, oil refinery they want to start refining crude oil and i think that's where their major focus is now yes they are still you know producing cement so that's why we have scarcity of cement in the country dave Mai is using cement to build his roads and remember we have thousands of hundreds or thousands of kilometers of roads to be constructed uh, uh, in these uh, federal government roads and not just that other state governors might of course borrow leave want to be using cement to build roads and it's even cheaper and better that's why you are finally difficult to buy cement now from sister uh, someone was saying making the analysis that factory price is 6,500 but if you go to retail shops you are getting it 14 to 15,000 naira that's terrible that's so terrible why would the federal government now make life difficult and unbearable for the citizens for nigerians dave umai told given jilos Bega and other construction companies that the federal government has hired to build roads make road construction the pattern the way they should build it and the major factor here is they are to use cement just like Dave Mahi used in the whole of a bony state I st have stayed there for one year and I saw the rules how good they are I mean how good the, these rules are with cement and that's what this has implemented because of course he's the minister for works and he has told them look if you are going to build roads for us you must use cement and that's why throughout this year it will be difficult for you to see cement come down to at least four thousand six thousand then Bua cement promised that his own cement will be going for three thousand five hundred but it's now looking like an audio promise because we don't get to see in you know, Bua cement anywhere uh, on you know, inside to buy he just made they may be to, 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 to impress Nigerians. It's looking like an audio promise. We can't see the cement anywhere. I want to ask a question. Throughout last year, 2020, and now in the new year, 2024, have you seen Bua cement in any shop going for even 4,000? We haven't seen. So why will he make such money? If he's serious, we will be glad to see his cement. But now that the Dango cement is going for 15,000, is nearly nearly impossible it's you know almost impossible for you to buy boa cement even at five thousand naira this is crazy to the federal government under the leadership of uh, parliament has caused every product in nigeria to skyrocket even pure water has increased what hope is tinubu renewing i can't I can't seem to find it. He has turned everything to the negative part.